life than pool. Play pool, play pool. Hello. Time for a test drive of a clean and completely new cue ball. And I found the scissors at last. They were under my pool table the entire time and I searched everywhere for the, the scissors. So time to try it. Time to try it. Try my new cue ball. First, first shot. Super Aramis Pro Pro Cup. Okay, let's try that. And here's my old old cue ball. And I'm going to try to see if it, if my new cue ball is a lucky cue ball. And the new one is a little darker, darker than the old one. This one came with the uh, set of balls. This one and it is whiter than the that the one you buy separately. Strange. And I, I have uh, another keyboard here. Also, this one it also came from, from, from a package, package like this. This one came from a package like this. And now I got the second one from this kind of package. And the one with, that came with the set is whiter than the other balls. And you see that yeah. this one, oh, so dusty, oh, this one. TV Pro Cup Aramis Tournament Duramis Duramis Technology and uh, this cue ball came from, from this set uh, and it is it is whiter than the ones you get from these uh, packages. These packages have a little darker color, more yellow color I think. So yeah, so that's the difference between them. And which one will I start with? Uh, yeah, I will just start with the clean keyboard. Immediately put them for washing. Okay. So now I have three cue balls. A perfect idea for the ball star cleaning machine. Because you will clean ten balls. If you play ten ball, you clean ten balls plus three uh, cue balls so what you do is when you put there are six slots eight eight slots eight slots in the ball star cleaning machine so you first you clean uh, eight balls then another eight balls so what you want to do is you want to clean the cue balls twice you clean the cue balls twice so you get uh, actually then you get uh, all slots will be used first you use you use five slots of object balls and three slots of cue balls. So you, you will have a full, uh, all the slots will be full and you clean twice. So you clean 16 balls. You see? Uh, three cue balls times two is six. So you clean six balls plus uh, 10 object balls. So 16 balls you will clean in the ball star cleaning machine. And it has eight, eight slots inside, eight plus eight is 16, so it is perfect, perfect to use three cue balls, okay. I would, I would really like to show you here, but I need to disconnect. I would just have to show you here. Oosh, ooh, so heavy. Oosh. So I just have to show you. Show you what I mean. I hope it's not dusty under. But yeah, I'm just ooh, some dusty machine here. I just have to show you what I mean. Okay, so it's difficult. Okay, so here are you see. A very important lesson here. So I need to show you uh, better. Eight eight slots inside the cleaning machine. Eight slots. I got to angle it. I will push and angle it, you see. Eight slots. 
eight slots inside. You clean the ball, cue balls, put all the cue balls there and put all the, uh, you put five object balls. I just have to do it. Okay, you see it is full. Cleaning machine is full. You clean all the balls. Okay, you take out, you take out the finished, the clean, clean object balls. And then you take these, these dirty ones, you take these dirty balls, do the second cleaning. Do the second cleaning. So you will clean all the object balls and the cue balls, the cue balls will be cleaned twice. And you see this is perfect. It is perfect to have three cue balls with the ball star cleaning machine. If you play 10 ball, okay? Perfect idea here. Three cue balls and you, you, you play, you clean all the balls. You, it is so, so dark in here. You clean all the balls, maybe once per week or maybe once per day. And then you, you split up the, the clean cue balls uh, among uh, three practice sessions. Okay, you have three cue balls here. You start, you start with the, the, you start with one cue ball. You play a practice session. You play a, maybe a match or something. You remove it, put it there. Take, take, uh, you take out the clean, another clean cue ball from the machine. You play a practice session. You finish it, you put it back. You take the next one, the third clean uh, cue ball. You play a practice session, you are finished. Time to clean all the balls. Okay, you do it like that. Clean all the balls. You do it again. So you always want to have a clean cue ball when you, when you start to play. Okay, maybe you play three times per week. Then you just clean every, all the balls once per week. And yeah, you just need to use a clean cue ball before every practice session. That's a very good idea. Very good idea. So is it time, is it time for a test drive here for my, with my new cue ball? So, yeah. It, it is not good to touch the balls with, with bare hands. You need to touch them with gloves. Ooh, I got dust, dust on my table from, ooh, from the Boston machine, I got dust. Hey, ooh. I will just put it back here and it is time for test drive soup. Hey. So heavy, heavy machine, heavy machinery, heavy machinery is what they have here and I like to put the I like to put the cable there behind so my dog doesn't eat it my dog has eaten a lot of my cables Whew, I got a little dizzy from all that carrying heavy heavy machinery is it time to play now yeah Time to play the pool. <laughs> so it was a long time since I stroked my cue. Start with something easy now. Something easy. So, chalk the cue. Okay. Let's see how this cue ball behaves. Whoa! <laughs> you saw the action I got there. Ooh. Tough shot uh, with a clean cue ball making a two rail kick shot is very difficult because it will just slide, slide when hitting the cushion. So instead of going there, it goes there. I'm going to sh show you, I'm going to try it anyway. Yeah, that's very really good. I compensated, I compensated for that. So let's see what happened there. What was, what was that? Is there something on the ball? It is not rolling straight. Is it rolling straight? Or, or is it the table that is wrong? It must be the table. Can't be the cue ball that is wrong. Rolling offline like that. I can see clearly that it is rolling. 
rolling of line. Yeah. Need to experiment to see what what if the ball is cue ball is good enough or not. Yeah, it is rolling pretty good here. Yeah? It would be very bad if I got the cue ball that was that was not rolling straight. Would mess up would mess up my game completely. There are some, there are joke uh, eight balls that, that don't roll straight. I just hope I didn't get something like that from Santa Claus. A joke cue ball that is not rolling straight. <laughs> that is something you give um, give to your opponent. You want him to play bad, so you give a gift, a cue ball that is not rolling straight. So it will completely mess up his game. So yeah, let's see what I can do here with this. Oh, oof. Yeah. Have I missed yet? I just made a kick, a kick shot there that I missed, but it was difficult. Let's see if I can do this. Cheat the pocket. Oof, that was close. There's a, some dust on the table from the, when I put the ball star cleaning machine on the table. I, I make a kick shot with the key, clean and cue ball. See what would happen. Does it grip? Does it grip? Yeah. Oh, ooh, yeah. Clean cue ball and ver working very good. Working very good. Let's see if I can do some spin, spinning, spinning shots. Spinning shots. Yeah, clean cue ball working very good. Working very good now. Let's see. Ah, ah hit the hit my chain with my cue. I hit the chain with my cue. It was, ah, there comes the first miss. Santa Claus gave me this chain, and I now I know why. Because then he will beat me. Let's let's make a long shot. Ah, it is cue is hitting my chain. Q is hitting my chain. It is hitting my chain. No, no, no. No, no, no. Santa Claus, I want to return your gift. Your chain, I want to return it. It is, it is messing up my game. It is messing up my game too much. Maybe I need to make it put it tighter. I need to put my chain tighter. I don't know how to remove it now. I don't know how to remove the chain. Ah! Once you put put on the chain the first time, you don't know how to take it off. Maybe, maybe that is what what Santa was planning for. That I don't know how to take I I don't know how to take this off. I put it on. I don't know how to take it off. I, I have no idea what to do. You know, just ooh yeah, it came off. There you go. There you go. Let's try this shot without the chain. Let's try it without the chain and see if I can do it. Yeah, you see, immediately I made it without the chain. So, thank you Santa Claus for the chain, but <laughs> I don't want to use it. It will, I will miss, I will miss with that, with that chain. I need to put it on tighter. I need to put the chain on tighter. So let's see if I can do some spinning. Spinning, you. It didn't grip so so good from from that way. <laughs> Almost a scratch. <laughs> Almost a scratch. Yeah. I'm just uh, shooting as hard as possible, hoping that it will go in. Try. I will try a kick shot with. Oh, there you see, close. Yeah, very good cue ball. Very good cue ball. Very good cue ball. I, I, I will try a three rail. Three rail kick shot. Three rail. 
kick shot. Oh shoot! I I want to shoot hard. It looks better. It looks better when shooting hard than soft. I will, I will shoot soft. It is, it is easier on this shot to shoot soft. Shoot soft easier. Yeah, you see, very close, very close. And I, now I will shoot hard. You see, I miss. I, you easily miss when you shoot harder. Now, what what am I doing? What am I doing? You see how difficult it is when shooting hard. So I will shoot soft again. This is a st standard standard shot for players to shoot shoot soft on the on this shot to win the game. So I don't know why you are supposed to do like that that but looks better. Yeah, there you go. There you go, finally. End of the test drive of my new cue ball. Okay, so this is the end of the video. Subscribe to my channel, check out my Patreon. Link is below for secrets. Secrets for the pros, for the amateurs, for the beginners, for everyone. Okay, so until next time, goodbye.